VST here guys, Ben Speaks Tech, and I have the Pixel 3a in my hand. As you can see guys, a system update is available and this is indeed the Android 12 Beta 4.1. So as you can see is a rather small and tiny update, I would say 15 megabytes, but hey, Let's download it, let's install it on my device and let's just see what the new changes are. Of course my battery is still low so I'm gonna have to charge my phone but be back with the update and of course with my review. So stay tuned. While I'm charging, let's view today's sponsor. CDK Deals is an official platform selling all type of software. There are super deals on games like the one from Steam or from Origin or from Uplay, but there is also software from Microsoft like Windows and Office. Navigating through the platform is very easy. Let me show you an example. I'm gonna be searching for Windows 10 Pro, press enter, now go to Microsoft Windows 10 Pro, hit the buy button and we are almost ready to go. And guys, you can now use my discount code VS25 for additional 25% discount. See here. Now you need to submit the order, complete the payment with your choice and press the pay now button. After the payment has been completed, go to your Windows settings, search for activation and enter the product key as simple as that and you're going to end up with a full license Windows in a matter of no time. And here it is. This is the Android 12 Beta 4.1 guys. So it is kind of a minor update, but still some important things has been fixed. I'm gonna be testing those for you and also gonna do kind of like a stability check. It's very important and I need to say it and I keep saying this since the Beta 4. I don't really think we're gonna get a Beta 5 or even if we get Beta 5 it's probably gonna be the last one. But why is this very important? The Beta 4 reach the platform stability which pretty much means that what I have here in my hand running on my Pixel 3a device is almost like 80 to 85 90 percent the stable Android 12. Now guys pay attention I have here the S21 Ultra in my hand and just today Samsung released an updated version from the one hand operation plus and why is that important because can you see here what's new Android 12 support added this pretty much means that Android 12 is very close also for Samsung running of course the One UI 4 which means that Android 12 stable version is going to be released very 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 soon all right, what is new? Those are the release notes from the Android 12 Beta 4.1. Okay, you can see the release date is the 25th of August 2021. This is the build here. It's SPB4 and you can see the rest. And guys, this is what has been fixed, right? Fix an issue that caused some devices to get stuck in boot loop after restarting a device. Luckily, I never had that issue. Fixed an issue where heads up notification were sometimes not shown, requiring the user to swipe into the notification drawer to view them. Luckily, don't have the issue as well. Fix an issue where the device volume control sometimes did not work when casting. And guys, I tested this on my device right now, not a problem at all. Fix an issue where the face unlock did not work on some devices. And guys, the last one is probably the most important one. Fixed an issue where after connecting the phone to a VPN, the phone could not connect to the internet. And that's the first thing I would like to test as soon as possible, right now. So I have here my tool bar, VPN client guys, and let's choose here Poland, right? I'm just going to hit continue, and I really will hope that VPN connection will work. Now you can see here, the tunnel bear is connecting myself to the VPN server and if everything works fine after the connection has been established I should be able to access some data on the interweb. Alright, still connecting? Let's try to see. Sometimes it takes a bit more time but if it does not really work then it's gonna be very bad. Alright, connected we can see the bear. Let's now open here Chrome and let's go here and just type what's my IP. What's my IP address is going to reveal us information. As you can see guys, my IP location is Warsaw, which is actually Poland. We know that the VPN has been fixed, so that's already a good news to start with. Let's take a swipe here and just check the Android version. It's exactly 4.1, one we expect to see here, 12 SPB4 
the two and etc this is the latest version so no big changes here guys let's do a stability check guys I'm just randomly browsing and again you need to have in mind that this is a very old device a fairly old device is the pixel 3a but honestly you can see I have some application loaded I even have some games loaded and not a problem at all everything is okay I would not say battery smooth right so it's not battery smooth but everything is really quite quite quick and I'm not sure guys but if you happen to have a phone released in the same year as the Pixel 3a you might want to test it and I probably will bet five dollars that my Pixel 3a running the Android 12 is gonna be really quick and guys that's I think a huge huge leap forward now Pixel or Google are going into the direction where already iPhone and Apple are you get a phone and you get two three four years of updates I think Samsung promised three years updates I think three years also for the Pixel devices probably a bit more so we are really happy to see the wider industry embracing this in this video today I'm guys to it's time right now for the volume control testing when we're casting so you see I'm playing here this directly from my phone guys and by the way if you want to check the best smartphone for 2021 you can check the video here what I'm going to do right now I'm going to press play and I'm going to get my volume control so all right see volume off I'm, I'm gonna pump the volume right and let's do this also here with the toggle and as you can see guys everything really works battery smooth so we can conclude I'm gonna disconnect right now we can conclude that volume control while casting has been really fixed I am not able to taste the face unlock because the Pixel 3a simply doesn't really support this but let's try to see what other things we have inside so we're gonna be checking here the home setting alright I'm gonna click on the about version 12 I want to check the application info the pixel launcher so the pixel launcher okay just version 12 okay that sounds quite nice right they don't really give a lot of information we have the live space adding the apps icon to home screen swipe to access Google application alright I think I have that the overview suggestions and suggestions for all apps on the home screen allow home screen rotation when phone is rotated and this is really very nice guys this is indeed what I love uh, from the Samsung phone because we have this or we have been having this on Samsung phone since forever right now natively stuck on the pixel phone on the launcher okay here we have the Google feed right you know the redesign does work quite well let's see also here guys the widgets do we finally have some of the new Google widgets sadly I don't think so probably widgets are gonna be one of the last things that Google will release so we just still have the old clock widgets and the new Android 12 widgets are really crazy guys so you might want to check my video here there is already an application that can get you the Android 12 widgets directly on your Android 11 if you're using UI or One UI whatever this is here the settings alright search settings network and internet let's just do a quick swipe here sim the airplane mode everything pretty much looks the same we have the connected devices here the option to pair a new device all right we have the applications where we can choose the recent open application you can see all the application you can choose the default apps a system screen time unused app special app access quite nice we have also notifications and all the settings there conversations priority conversations the bubbles device and app notifications notifications on the lock screen sensitive notification do not disturb emergency alerts hide silent notifications in the status bar you have a plenty of options guys now all of this right now is stock and that's really great let's see the battery menu all the menus look very simple it sometimes reminds me on the Windows mobile the one we have on the Nokia Lumia and etc okay battery percentage and by the way see all the animations are very very fancy guys let me just try to remove that one you can see when you put the percentages you know everything really is very fluid very very nice sound and vibration okay you have the menu volume the call volume by the way when you press the volume rocker guys you click here you have this sound media call ring and etc I really hope that they're gonna put back like the big bars the one that we have in the one year because this doesn't really look too consistent okay let's check the storage menu storage menu all right it pretty much looks like the one we have in the battery then you have the free up space this is now using Google files it will allow you to search for some large files and eventually delete that one then we have all the display settings okay the screen timeout the dark theme the phone the nightlight the colors and etc and etc then we have the security security is very important you can just see the security update from the 5th of August all right it's really very very up-to-date the Google Play system though is a bit old pixel imprint smart lock 
screen lock device admin apps encryption trust agents everything you will ever need then we have the privacy okay privacy dashboard how many times the camera was accessed how many times the location was accessed which application are using location or camera and which application are using microphone and etc so we have a tons of extras here safety and emergency digital well-being if you are a fan of okay digital well-being then boom you have it there right and then of course you have the about phone with a lot of information the software and etc and then we have tips and support this will guide you here to a pixel page you can describe your issue you can search some popular articles and etc overall let's do one more time a check this stability is really great guys right you can go here and you can do a screenshot you can do markups you know all of those things already been shown in my other reviews right you know about the screenshots for some reason they're not working here when you press this inside the chrome you just get here the share option and also the markup but allow me to go in my settings inside the settings where we have really a very long menu when you press this you're gonna get this button here capture more when you press capture more guys you'll see how your phone is going to start capturing more and you know the, the, the way they implement it is quite nice I don't really think I've seen something like this in another Android implementation or let's say another Android skin I really hate the word skin but okay that fork but you can just do like this or like this so it's very very easy to use and you just pray safe and boom but let's check if the share button from the recent menu is still there if you open a browser okay and you go here boom automatically copy you can just copy share it seems that all the features from the previous betas of course are here but some widgets are missing okay the wallpaper colors the basic colors here the dark theme is there seems to be quite nice the application grid the team icons they were also there in the last beta 4 now I think it's even a bit quicker and a bit more stable the fluidity is really crazy for a phone such old and guys we are very very close in getting Android 12 on our other beloved devices so the time is very short and I really hope that I'm gonna be able to get one a 4 here with Android 12 on my Samsung S21 Ultra and also on my other phones that I have here lying somewhere so guys if you have joined content like this don't forget to like the video subscribe to this channel please you and your families guys stay safe until we meet in one of the next videos with that said VST over and